Yo, what's good everybody? Barl here with another streaming tutorial. Uh, I know a lot of you guys have been asking about a Nightbot tutorial, so we finally got one out for you guys. So, for those of you that don't know, Nightbot is something that sits in your chat and responds to commands and also moderates your stream. You can use it for commands, you can use it for timing out or banning people, you can use it, use it for like giveaways, you can use it for, you know, music playlists. But uh, there's a lot of different things that Nightbot can do for you and your stream. Uh, you can also have like custom commands, so it will tell your stream, like your viewers, how long you've been streaming for, what's your gamer tag. You know, you can use it to share your socials, all stuff like that. So if you guys have any questions, you know, please leave them below. Hopefully, uh, I can answer them by the end of the video. But if not, you know, feel free to DM me on you know Twitter, Instagram, uh, you know, a comment below, whatever. But I uh, hope you guys enjoy it, and yeah, peace. All right, guys, so the first thing you're going to want to do is going to want to go to nightbot.tv right there. You're going to want to go to sign up, log in with Twitch. Uh, I'm going to use a different account for tutorials, so we're going to click out of here, go to not you, switch to this one. You're going to log in, um, authorize. Cool. So the first thing you're going to want to do when you get to this page is you're going to want to go to join channel and this is going to connect your nightbot with your twitch so you're going to click join channel you're going to it's going to tell you that you need to go to your twitch channel and type slash mod and nightbot in your own chat so that way the nightbot software can make commands and do all the things that you're about to set it to do while you're streaming so we're going to go over to twitch and do that right now so just go up Go to your Twitch page. You're gonna want to go to. I think you just go to your channel. Yeah, you go to your channel. You're gonna type in slash mod and then Nightbot right there. And then it will tell you up in the top right corner of your chat that you have net added Nightbot as a moderator of your channel. All right, awesome. So then you go back to Nightbot. You can close this up. And then we're gonna move on to commands. So you're gonna want to go to commands in the top left corner. Click commands, then click default. Nightbot gives us this list of default commands that they already have set up for your stream. Personally, I don't really use any of these. If you want to use them, you can. Uh, you can just go here and click disable if you don't or enable if you want to use them. The only one that I really use is this commands one right here. It basically puts a list of all the commands you have set up for your stream in your chat. So that way users or whoever can click on it and see what commands you have and you know maybe your moderators could add some stuff if they want or you guys can take stuff out but it's really up to your discretion uh, the rest of these if you want to find out what they do you can just click docs right here and it'll help you figure out how to edit it or what the command itself does but really most of the stuff we do are in custom commands so we're going to go over here click on custom and then go to add command nightbot gives us a filler which is this youtube one so exclamation point YouTube, subscribe to my YouTube channel is the message that's going to show up in your chat and then your YouTube link. You can set the user level, like who's allowed to do the command. Personally, I have all my commands set to everyone so that way everyone can interact with the chat. However, I would recommend putting down a cooldown so that way people uh, don't spam your chat with you know some of your commands. So I normally have everything set to 10 to 30 seconds. It's up to you. Just choose whatever you feel is right for your stream. And yeah, so let's just do a basic command right now. We'll do Twitter. So you can do Twitter, and then you can do uh, check out my Twitter, as simple as that. And you go and grab your URL, copy, paste. Uh, you want to make sure you space it out a little bit, and then do enter so that way it doesn't show up all squished in your chat. And then you just go to submit, click that. And if you want to test it out, you go over to your stream, go to your stream chat, do exclamation point Twitter, what we just set up, and then you'll see right there, it says check out my Twitter, and then there's a link. And you can just click on the link, and then it'll take you right to your Twitter. So, pretty easy, not too bad. The next thing we're going to focus on is giveaways. So once you click on giveaways, you'll have three panels that are going to pop up. You'll have users, which should show all the eligible users in your chat. You have the eligibility right here and then the giveaway beneath it and then you have your stream chat on the right. Um, so first you can mess around with the eligibility. So you could just pick mods, you could just pick subscribers, you could just pick everybody if you'd like, um, as long as they have the blue bar around them. 
And then the first type of giveaway is active user. You can change the more likely someone will win the giveaway uh, right here. So if they're a subscriber, you can make it 10 times more likely to win. If they're a regular, you can make it 10 times more likely to win or anything in between. It's up to you guys. And then uh, active users. So you want to make sure that it's people within, you know, however long they've been active in your chat. So say like 10 minutes, 15 minutes, 5 minutes, whatever. You can select that down here. Um, then the other type of giveaway they have is keyword. You can put a keyword in there. We put in poggers. And then uh, if someone spams it, you can just click this so that way they can't spam the keyword more than however many times. And then you can also change the luck again. And you can also do a uh, random number giveaway right there. So next you can move on to logs. This just kind of shows you about you know what you added to your stream and what Nightbot has done in your streams. You can click on regulars. We'll show the regulars that have been coming through to your stream and how often and all that kind of stuff. And then uh, you can also click here and go to song requests for auto DJ and even you can upload your own playlist in here if you'd like. Um, I'm going to do a separate tutorial on this because this is pretty extensive. Um, it's going to be a lot of work, but we're going to do that in the future. And then next moving on to spam protection. After clicking on spam protection, you can get over to this list right here and it's kind of similar to the default commands where you can enable or disable these as you'd like. Uh, if you click on options, you can add to these commands and you know set things that you want to block for your, from your stream. Um, you can also click docs to find out more about the command itself. So say for blacklisted words or phrases, you would just come here, go to options. You can add in a phrase that you don't want in your stream. You can set out timeout length if you'd like. Uh, you can set an exempt level. So say you allow your moderator to say something like that, but maybe not everyone in your stream. It's really up to you. And then you can set a custom message too. So say you timed out someone for saying something you didn't want. You, it'll send them a message automatically saying, hey, like I timed you out because, you know, whatever you want to say. You can just put that right in here and then hit submit. And then anytime someone would use that in your chat, they'll automatically get timed out and then sent a message if that's what you decided to set it as. Um, and then lastly, we have timers. So personally, the only timer that I have set up is uh, my social links. And it's actually kind of like the preset one that they have here. So we're just going to go through and do that right now. So for instance, I have exclamation point social. And then I have, uh, you know, you could say, you could just say like the simple one that everyone does, connect with me or, you know, whatever else you want to do. And then you can just put all your social links down here. So we'll just grab my YouTube and grab that. I just remember to put that space in there. And then we'll put the Twitter. And yeah, that's all, that's all I really do for now. Just keep it easy. Uh, you can set an interval, so that way it only appears like every 15 minutes, 20 minutes, hour, whatever. I do every 15 minutes. And then this is the minimum amount of space in between the chat lines, so that way it's not like spamming your stream if you know no one's really interacting. So I set it to like five lines, so that way it's not, you know, it's not too annoying in the chat. And then you just click submit, and that would save the, the timer for it right there. And then it should show up in your chat every like 15 minutes. So if you want to check that, you know, obviously when you're live, that's when uh, you can check it. And then if you want to disable it, you can just go to disable. If it's getting annoying, you can edit it here or you can just delete it and make a new one. Um, other than that, there's nothing really else that Nightbot does for you. Um, we can set up a song request thing in the future. So that way I can teach you guys more about that. But uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed it. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Um, if you guys have any questions, comments, whatever, you know, just drop them below. I got you. If uh, anyone needs anything, you can obviously contact me through Twitter, Instagram, uh, the comments below, whatever you guys need to do. By all means, I'm here for you guys. I'm trying to help as much as I can. Uh, I know a lot of people also asked about the song request or DJ Nightbot video, so we're going to be doing that in the future. It's a little extensive, so I didn't want to add it into this really long video. But uh, definitely going to be doing that in the future. If you guys want to see any other videos or if you need help with anything, just please write a comment below. I'd love to do a video on it to help, you know, whoever I can. Um, but other than that, guys, like the streams lately have been insane. I really appreciate everybody's support on everything. You know, I'm really trying to get into creating more content for you guys, but as well as streaming as much as I can. So it's definitely a crazy balance with work. But uh, I appreciate you guys that are sticking with me through everything. So shout out to you guys for being fucking awesome. Like I couldn't ask for better people to be associated with. Um, but other than that, you know, that's it. Uh, if you guys, you know, have anything, criticism, whatever it may be, just leave it below. 
Uh, so hopefully I can work on something and make this more enjoyable for you guys. But uh, other than that, yeah, guys, have a great day. Hope you enjoyed it. Peace.